solve for integers x, y, given that 3 to the power x minus 3 to the power y equals 58,320. From the given equation, we know that x must be greater than y because x is greater than y. So we let x equal y plus k, where k is a positive integer. Then equation 1 can be written as 3 to the power of y plus k minus 3 to the power of y equals 58,320. 3 to the power of y plus k can be written as 3 to the power of y times 3 to the power of k. Now we can see that the two terms have a common factor, 3 to the power of y. So we can factorize the left hand side of the equation and we can now write 3 to the power of y times 3 to the power of k minus 1, 58,320 is even. 3 to the power of y must be odds. So 3 to the power of k minus 1 must be even 58,000 Three hundreds and twenty can be written as two to the power of four times three to the power of six times five, two to the power of four times five is even. So three to the power of y must equal three to the power of six, three to the power of k minus 1 must equal 2 to the power of 4 times 5, which is 80. So 3 to the power of k equals 81, which can be written as 3 to the power of 4. So y equals 6, k equals 4. We know that x equals y plus k, so x equals 10, y equals 6. So this is the only third of solutions.